Here, it's a different phone for the date, time, and all that. All right. This is uh, Friday, July 29, 6:37 p.m. Right. And I can't even see the screen right. What happened here? Okay. So here I am, and I've had some recent conversations with people about <clears throat> this particular model right here. Let me just stand up and play it for you. All right. So. Here is this model right here. It's a, what is this? This is a 543ADS, all right? And uh, if you turn it, it's on battery, so if I put it on radio. For more than 38,000 securities, that, so we can better stress test. Hey, go there. People on. everywhere. Once again, here's it's Pastor that. Rick. That and this one. And your family is not that. a business. You put it on that and you hit tape, right? I got this tape in here. Let's hit play. Give it a second. All right, so, yeah. There's that. And then I it and use the tape counter. Right? And uh, cue it forward to about 16. nothing but it does that and I'm going to rewind, rewind it back to zero so I put in another machine okay so that's about right I'm good so hit stop hit eject okay now that was your opener right so here it is it looks like that where is the uh, part number okay so there it is can you see the part number if I bring it up close will it focus quickly Hopefully you can see that. That's what it is. It's running on batteries. It's got this on this end. It's got that on that end. All right, so I'm going to put this down over here out of the way. Okay, great. So there we go. So now, now, I want to... Okay, someone was asking me about the Panasonic RX 5050. And so I got the search in my computer, and I came across just this bunch of pictures, right? So... That's close enough. So I'm trying to have dinner here. So there is the 50-50s. I had three of them. And I want to point out that this is the, that's the 50-50F. Okay. No longer have that model. Okay. I sold that to a gentleman in Australia. And this was set up for 120 volts. He has 220 volts over there. He plugged it in and fried the transformer. So that's on him. Sorry. I can't remember everybody's country's voltages and such. And then here are the other two that I've had or have. Okay, so that one's this, that's that one there. And then this is this one here. So notice this one has whatever it shows on the door, which is nothing. All right. And this one here has that, which is very hard to see in this picture. Okay. But I just want to impress that upon you that I sold this one here. But I still have that one, right? Now I'm going to show you the original picture. <laughs> what does that date say right there, people? Okay, you know what date that is? Okay, so now moving along, just showing you this is a bad photo, but there it is. And hey, let's turn the lights on. <laughs> okay, so this is from what year is today? It's 20, this is 22, so this is, uh, you do the math, that's what, 15 years ago? So 15 years ago, I had these things. And there is, my golly, there is that, and there is the other 50-50. Okay, so I'm not going to bore you with this, but and then here's just other models that I've had years ago. Right? And um, yes, I had a six-figure thing, but I sold that a couple of years ago now. And, uh, yeah, whatever. Okay, so, yeah. Another picture. Let's see what else. Okay, and then here is my living room picture. Again, 2007. Another picture, another picture. And then here's just a. Anyway, 
just radios that I've had, some I still have. Okay. Here's just another picture, okay. And then a fuzzy picture, and a little sharper now. Okay. And then, <laughs> whatever. And the same. And we're back to the middle room. Okay, so once again, I don't know how, anyway. Yeah, yeah. And here's a little Sonic I used to have. I sold that. There's a Toshiba, there's a Sanyo, there's the 5050 again. Okay, and then just, oh, here's a couple of Sansui's, let's see here. This is the uh, CP99, yeah, this is a CP99W, and above it is a, a 77. Let's see, wait, can we see that up there? Yeah. I still have two of this model, okay. Still have two of that model. All right, great. Um, there's the same thing again. All right, now we turn the lights on. <laughs> okay, and um, we have the, you know, I, I still have this box here. I still have this Sony CFS 500 in the box. And I still have the Toshiba and I still have this General Electric and other radios. Okay, so, and then these, uh, JVC, JVC, and then that's a fuzzy picture. Don't care. And I don't know what that is. And yeah, well, running Windows 98 here on this on that screen. And there's a couple of those. And that's my car, my truck, my old truck. Don't have my orange truck there. Wait, what happened? Okay, so that that. I still have, let's see, I still have the Hitachi, the, I still have that, this one, I still have that, still have that, sold this one, sold that one, still have this one, yeah, okay, uh, still have that somewhere, let's see, what do we got here, what do we got, I sold this black one, bought a beige one, I'm keeping the beige one, there's one of my JVC tape decks, I have one or two of these, one with a box. I sold this Lasonic. And, oh gosh. I can't remember if I sold this or if I still have it or what. Okay. Probably sold that one. All right. Yeah. Okay, so. Yeah, I had three of these. Or, you know, I sold two to California. There's a. 5010. Okay, and then there is a. I need the gears for this one. I probably still have this piece of junk, this Magnavox somewhere. Here's a. Um, what is that? That's a DD9. I have two of that model. Here we are in the old stereo to go place. No longer, but anyway. Here's a picture of both together. The, again, the one with the that there. This is 2008 now, all right? So, there's a General Electric. I still have this analog model. There it is again. Again. Um, yeah, there's that. I still have, well, whatever. Yeah, okay. So that, 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 that. I saw these in the store at Fry's Electronics. It's no longer in business. This went for $199, I think. Anyway, or... Yeah, who knows? All right, so yeah, is this a better picture showing the price? Yeah, one ninety nine. Who cares? Right. Yeah, there it is. Oh, look at that. Real good. Yeah, that's what I went for back then. So, <laughs> what year is this? Two thousand eight. Okay, there you go. Oh, who cares? All right, there's that. That. Wait, yeah. So I have this one here still like that condition in the box there. Uh, I don't know. Let's see here. Okay. Yeah, this was sold. I still have this one, I think. Yeah, there it is again. Yeah, the back. Okay, you know what the back looks like, right? Here, okay, these have line in. 
Okay, there's the line in, and this is identical, has line in, right? Here's the top. This one has, you know, the five band EQ, right? So it has, you know, your ambience, your line in, your radio, and your four bands, and this one only has AM and FM ambience, your radio line in, and your metal tape, and all that. Okay, so well, that's what the difference is. The F model doesn't have your tape uh, controls. It just takes regular tape. Okay, so that's the difference between the F and the uh, standard 50-50, for those of you that are interested in getting the F model. Uh, what happens now? Is the computer crashing? The computer's crashing. No, it did. Well, it did something funny. Here's the Sears model. I still have this one somewhere. It's all right. I still have that. That's yeah, okay. I still have this model. Okay. Here we go. What else? This is a model that I bought for myself before I got a new boombox, and I still have this with the box. It's a double cassette radio CD player with. Control with, um, I made a video about this a long time ago, maybe under my other YouTube account, Decent Man for You, I don't remember, but this still works, okay? <clears throat> my, okay, the other, well, there we go. There's a couple of those. Again, I, I sold the, I sold this one, I sold that one, I still have this. No, I sold that one, I still have that one, I still have that one. Yeah, okay, no. All right, and then I still have the LPC 109 for sale. What is this picture of? This is a picture of, let's see, I sold the Gold Star, I sold the Zenith. I still have this Toshiba. Um, I still have that. I'm working on that one there. I have one of these, I think. I have one of those. Uh, I have this FM30 right here. And I have that one. I have this National Panasonic 5180, okay, and I might have this General Electric down here, I'm not sure, okay, good. That was 2009, this bunch of computers. Here's a uh, Telefunken I used to have. I sold that to a person in Pennsylvania, okay, and does that case look familiar to anybody? <laughs> Okay. Oh, here we are. Yeah, I did have two of these. I did have two um, 777s, and I sold them back in the year 2011. Okay, so I did have two of those. Now I only have one because I bought another one in the year 2014, which is not for sale. So here's the, again, this is, what is this? I have this Midland, if anyone's interested in it. I still have that. I sold the Zenith. Um, this got this one. This blue, this one here went to uh, Italy a few months ago. Um, I might have that one still. This one I might have. Uh, this is a FM30. I have two of that model, I think. I sold the uh, F33 to somebody, and I still have these Sanyos, and I also have this Hitachi. It needs fixing. Okay. What else? <clears throat> I have about seven or eight of this model, two with boxes, one with original stuffing. Okay. And whatever. And then there's a cat. And, oh my God. That's me in 1978 in the Army. Yeah, that's me and my boss. So I was a, a PFC. Okay. He's a, a specialist. And here's my, um, here's my, I'll be brief, Pioneer uh, SK114, I think it is. I, I have that model somewhere. Okay. Uh, I'm weighing something. Wait, what am I weighing? I am weighing, that's a Canayan C100F that I'm weighing. So it weighs, you know, 25.8 pounds. That's too much to carry around. Here's a, well, who cares? All right. And this is again the middle room with the you know the Walkmans and such on the shelf here. 
and whatever. Okay. What else? And here's the back of it. Oh, I don't own this. This is somebody else's pictures. I can race through that. Oops, no wait. Wait, go back. Yeah, I did have an M70 right there, new in the box. I sold that for $3,200 to somebody in Ohio, if I remember right. Merrill Lynch person. Okay, so I had that. I sold it for $3,200 way back when. So here's, I don't have these models either. I sold these both to somebody in California way back 12 years ago. All right, same thing here. I don't have this one. And then we've got, I don't know what this is. Okay, so then I had, what did I have? I think I still have this funny looking auto reverse model. I know I sold the Lasonic 931. I know I sold that thing. And here's a, gosh, what is that? Emerson 965, I think, double cassette something. I made a video about that and sold it. Uh, what else? And I sold the Helix finally, yay, to somebody in Pennsylvania. Here is a, that's a, that's a Victor. Can't see the name, but that's a Victor because AM and FM. What else? Um, I still have this one, sold that. I think this one's Italy. And the rest of these I've already said enough about. Oh, here we go. I sold this one. I can't remember to who, I, I don't have it anymore. I sold this one, but I, I bought another one. So, and I fixed the tape deck and it made a video about that. There we go. Here's an M50. Here's a, okay, I sold this one and I bought another one. So I have another one now. We're back to that. And what is this? This is a, okay, I, I sold this to the gentleman in Jacksonville, Florida. That's all I'm going to say. Oh, and then here we're getting close to the end. All right. So this is a, <laughs> I wish I had bought this. The guy wanted eight bucks and I just didn't have the extra money at the time, but I just thought it was cute, so I took a bunch of pictures of it. But there it is, Grand Prix Music Bus. Okay, and so the cassette goes in there and it's just a cute little thing. And, I wish I had it because I drive a bus. I just didn't drive a school bus at the time, but now I do, and so this would have been so cool to have, but oh well. So if you come across one, let me know. And then we're back to this, so yeah. Okay, enough of that. So now, now I want to, what do I want to do? I want to get the phone out of the way, okay. and I'm going to wide out, all right? So wide out, 18 minutes. Okay, is that all the way? Wait, all the way. Okay, great. So now, now I want to get this here. Okay, this gun down there. So that, this. All right. So here's this. Let's see, can we get that up on the counter? Right, so move this out of the way. Get that out of the way. All right. So here is the. Um, okay, this plugged in. I didn't take the time to put batteries in it, but it does work on batteries. I guarantee you. Okay, so I see here. So I put it like that, and I can move the camera. How about let's do that? Give you a better straight-on view. All right, so come on down some. All right, great. And then come into it. All right, so that's good enough. All right, great. So now here is this. Uh, let me get some light on this thing because I don't have any light on it. So, so there it is. It, Got your okay. So if I turn it on, see here. This has got radio. Wanted to know why some people who get COVID 19 get it so bad. I found out it may be because they have a high. Move on, be one. It's para activar. First, to you. Radio stereo light comes on. All right. <laughs> So much for AM. But I'm not here. 
play that, so let's turn that off. Get my tape. Right, so hopefully I queued it up right in the sear. So we hit inject. Right. So but, and wait, it goes in this way, like that. Okay. So that's in there. Right, that's in there like that. Now before I play this, I want to get this. Get my uh, CD player. You know, with the the wire. Okay, well, anyway, the, anyway, plug this into the Bach. Right, does it go on the back? No, it one. Where's, it goes on the side. Okay, it goes on the side. Right, so here is the. Okay, red to red, and white to white. Okay, so just, you see that doing right. So here's the the wire. Turn this thing on. Right, so hit that. There it goes, spinning up. Great. Okay, so now. Uh, Well, it's making a noise. Okay, let's just stop that. Get on there. Right, so now it hits. All right, now no, no noise. So it wasn't on there properly. Great, now it counted up. I want to just hit that. I want to hit play. Come on, play. There we go. Get it going there. Okay, so now we flip it up to. There's that. Right? That's the CD player playing, okay? I can play this music over the internet and not have an issue. So. There's that. Alright, so. Uh, now I want to show you the equalizer working. Okay, so. Little volume. Like that. to hear the high frequency, but there it is, right? So. Search, but you can do this all day long, all right? You can go back and do that. And, okay, so I just want to oops, keep messing with that. So, there it is, working. It's got parallel meters, right? it's got balance, that works, that works to that side, back in the center. And it's got, uh, got ambience. Song. 
flip it back over to this, which is the line in, which we have on pause. We hit let's see, play. Well, that's still on pause. Alright, so now while that's working, I'm just gonna wide up. So I'm going to go back to this machine here, which is um, this one here. Okay, this is also a, a National Panasonic RX. Uh, I'm sorry, RQ 543ADS, and just briefly toss this tape in. And that's the wrong side, but it, um, okay, well that's fine. Hit play. So there's that. Uh, there's that. Put it on radio. Fine. Stop. Hit. Reject. There's my tape. So they both work. This is for sale. It's been for sale. It's, anyway. This one is earmarked for someone else. He's already inquired about it. That's why I'm making the video today and giving you a little picture history of what's in my computer regarding pictures of that. Alright, so. Hope you enjoyed. This is my today's video, if you will. I've already had a fun day. All right. Well, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I gotta go have dinner. Bye bye. Hi. Where's the Where's the off button? Just hit the back of the thing. How about all right? So, 